Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We are here at RV Open House in Elkhart, Indiana, taking a look at some of the newest and latest and greatest RVs. This being one of the smallest B plus Class C motorhomes, and it's perfect for somebody who's looking for a mobile office. This is the 2023 Gulfstream BT Cruiser model 5210. We are gonna be taking a look at the outside features first, then the inside features, then we're gonna give you three things we love about the BT Cruiser and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Again, welcome back to another video again today I am super excited that we are taking a look at the BT Cruiser and I just lied to everybody about 30 seconds ago we are gonna be starting on the inside first because of the rain then the outside before we begin let's say hi to Andrea hey Andrea hey everybody how's it going today it's going good you guys we're here in Elkhart Indiana we're just happy to be here happy to see these new RVs yes. and a shout out to Sue Sue who is the interior designer for Gulfstream what she ran up to you Andrea <laughs> and what did she say she's like you hate my balances. And I'm like, oh, what a sweetheart. And you know, I really do appreciate, you know, people when they come back to me about my feedback, but it's just my personal opinion. Yes. Uh, to each their own. To each their own. But here we go. What I told Sue is you might have the sweetest peach on a tree. Some people just don't like peaches. <laughs> Andre, and you know what I don't like? The rain. Me either. That's why we're starting inside. Let's begin. Model is... No, no, no. We're going to start... Okay, yeah, yeah, I can do that. Model is 5210. The actual tip tip length is 22 feet, 1 inch. Uh, sitting up here in the cockpit area, Andrea, this does have the 7.3 liter V8 Godzilla engine. We're here. We got the nice steering wheel. Pretty traditional cockpit area. Right here, that's where your cameras are going to be. We'll check out the cameras in a bit. Cup holders and everything. Andrea... Sit in the co-captain oh, seat. Matt, I did, we did forget the cargo capacity. Uh, we so. didn't forget it. We just haven't done it yet. We will get it. I feel like when we go out of order, we do forget it. I know, I know. How do you feel right there? Uh, it's comfortable, actually. You yes. Know, the seat is actually really comfortable. Um, yeah, it feels great. I have plenty of leg space. You know, typical, what is this, 350? Yep, E350. Okay. And Andre, this is such a small motorhome. There's no bed in here. It's just like it's a perfect mobile office area. And we don't have a bunker with a cab, but that's okay because we have storage and we have the TV right here. Yes. Nice white cabinetry. Pretty cabinetry. Yes. And then we have Andrea's favorite brand of television. Attitude. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> what are you trying to say, Matt? I'm not saying nothing, Andrea. You're the best wife I've ever had. Aww. Okay. You can swell the like TV that. out that's, that way. Yeah, that's good. Yes. Now, Andrea, last time we did one of these was about a year ago. You had a sofa over yes. here, and it had the optional sofa over here, which I loved. Um, this one has the sofa and the dinette. Again, I don't have a problem with the dinette. I love how they at least make it an option. Hey, if you want two sofas, right. do it that way. If you like the dinette, do it that way. Okay. okay cabinets above. Very nice. Check out these balances. Denied. Womp, womp. Sorry, Sue. How could you do that to Sue? Sorry, Sue. <laughs> How could you do okay, that? Okay, I got a lot of grief for this, but I swear you guys, it's not that bad. It just, it's, it looks, it looks different in person. Andrea, That's all. It's a little crazy for me. Andrea, you're either approved or denied. We got uh, privacy shades. Yes. Very nice. And then right here, this does drop down to make a bed. And for a dinette, it's not bad. You got grapes and everything. Um, This makes a bed and, you know... And it's Matt, you know, this RV has, yeah, it has no slides in it, so this right. is how it is at all time. And then it's over just... here, Andrea, we have more storage above, which is very nice. And then we do have the jackknife sofa, tri-cushion jackknife. Now, you guys are going to be looking at this thinking, well, one, this is nice. Um, but you guys are going to be looking at this thinking, hey, um, what the heck am I trying to say? Oh, where am I supposed to sleep tonight? Right? That's probably what you're wondering. Because there's no master bedroom. There's no bedroom in here at all. So what you actually do, Miss Andrea, is you go like this. Bada bing. Bada boom. Just like that. And now you're sleeping. Okay. Very comfortable and nice. And then, uh, oh, we do know. 
Andrea, do you know what time it is? It's now time for the MSRP. Let's check this out. MSRP on this motorhome. Actually, you know what I'm gonna do? Let's give a big shout out to RV Life, then we're gonna give you the MSRP. Matt's RV Reviews is proudly sponsored by RV Life. Tools that make camping simple. Everybody knows when it comes to camping, it can be a little stressful, but not with RV Life. So first, discover, research campgrounds and other locations of interest with detailed information, but for RVers. Plan your trip accordingly with the popular Trip Planner. That software is amazing. It's gonna tell you the best routes and you can go with your RV safe GPS. Not only are you typing in your specifications so it knows not to take you under any low bridges, but you can actually use that offline. So so if you're at a place with no Wi-Fi, you'll still have your GPS and you can share it with their RV community, guys. RV Life is more than just an app. It's an awesome program that all RVers should have. What we're doing is a free seven-day trial for Matt's RV Reviews customers and 25% off on top of that. So all you do is go to their website, rvlife.com, sign up for the free seven-day trial by clicking our link down below or typing in Matt's RV Reviews. Don't download the app because you, then you won't get the free seven days. So do it on the website, register Matt's RV Reviews, then download the app. We appreciate RV Life for sponsoring this video and sponsoring Matt's RV Reviews. Let's continue the video. Well, Andrea, do you know what time it is? It's now time for the MSRP. And Andrea, we, we actually have- know it. Well, I know the invoice because we said that as the MSRP, but you guys hopefully won't see that. Um, because hopefully Jen's doing a good job and edited that part out because we can't tell everybody the invoice <laughs> There'd be no more Matt's RV That's reviews. Right. So Miss Jen work your magic and make the MSRP appear right Bing. Oh right there. That is the MSRP of this unit guys listen, you're not paying MSRP but you're also not paying dealer invoice. <laughs> but there Somewhere is Somewhere in between. There's a right price that we sell this in. And again, I believe we only sell this at our motorhome specialist location, which always gives phenomenal prices. So if you guys are interested in this unit, uh, go to go, just go to our partner, motorhomespecialist.com. Then we're going to have the MSRPs, the sale prices of all their units. And they're going to make sure you guys get a great price, great service, and the best RV buying experience on a Gulfstream. Andrea, show us this kitchen. Okay. We got storage here above. Very cute. I mean, you know, it's a very small motorhome, but it's got a really cute kitchen. So we have solid surface countertop, very pretty. Got a round sink. Yes. Okay. Got a little bit of counter space here. Okay. Uh, we got a convection, wait, microwave. This microwave. is a microwave. And then we've got a three burner propane cooktop. Very nice. With an oven. Oh, would you look at that? Wow. And then I totally missed those. I'll go that way. We got a drawer down here. We've got more storage here. Very nice. And then we've got two drawers right here. Whoa. So yeah, I definitely think it's good for a mobile office, like you said. Now this is pretty cool. Would you look at that? Having this refrigerator size in here is yes. great. This Let is a two-way fridge. Very nice. Uh, electric and propane. Yes, ma'am. And then over here, we have your panel for all that, your lights and all that, tanks. And then we can look like a uh, wardrobe slash, you know, if you want to use it for pantry, closet whatever and then you got two drawers here yes ma'am all right matt let's check out this bathroom is that my phone dinging check it out all right okay little bathroom not it's still better than a class b right you got a good size shower yes ma'am right not here. a list door let me see it's uh just a yep. same size shower as what's in ours okay and then we've got a medicine cabinet here yes good sink out of the way cabinet here and let's see if it's a prime pooping position is it porcelain Andrea I got <laughs> something to say so for it's very 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 close but we gotta stay true this is not a prime pooping position womp, 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 womp. but when we walked into this display Sue bum rushed us and she grabbed a hold of me and she said, Matt, she pretty much said without saying it, get your ass over here. <laughs> and she threw me in the bathroom of a unit we just yes. reviewed five days Which ago. Which has porcelain in it now. And it now has porcelain. She <laughs> said, you got to retake the toilet test. So uh, she brought 
the our videos over to I guess the boss, and now they're putting pours and toilets and everything, yes. which is big kudos. But unfortunately, this floor plan is not a prime poop position. But I gotta tell you, it's not bad because you still have a lot of room. So it is what it is, it Andrea. Is it you is want something small, small? Yeah. This. Hey, I've seen worse, Matt. Yes. Well, Andrea, let's take a look on the outside. All right. Looks like the sun's coming out. Oh man, sun's out, guns out, guns a blazing. Damn. Oh, it's windy. Oh. Still windy. Still windy. Okay. Oh no. Very windy. So coming in on the outside, Andrea, this does sit on the E350 chassis. Look at these tires, Andrea, they're hand cooks. Dynapro. I love those. These are the uh, LT. LT225-75 R16 with the shiny rims there. Again, no seams in the um, over cab. It's not a bunk over the cab, but the entertainment over cab. Got a nice running board right there. Very nice power awning with LED lights. Frameless windows, which looks absolutely fantastic. And then here we do have some storage underneath there. Electrical outlets. Yes, ma'am. Small wheelbase, Andre. Small RV. Nice ride. Yes. Right here is propane. And we'll put the specs right here. Bing! For everybody who is watching on television. Thank you, Miss Jen. Thank you, Jen. Thank you. Yes. Right here is the water heater. And then coming around the back, we do have a nice fiberglass rear cap. Spare tire, spare tire carrier. Andrea, we do have a 7,500 7, pound hitch. We're telling you you're good for 5,000 pounds. You do have a ladder to get up on the roof, which we're not climbing because it's wet, cold, and rainy. And then there is a- Backup, backup camera. Yes. And then Andrea, you know what I haven't said all week? What's that? If you haven't already, make sure you guys smash the <laughs> thumbs up button. What are the RV salesmen's coming to Elkhart, Indiana for open house? Nobody. To bring you some of the newest, latest, and greatest. Nobody, Matt. Nobody, ma'am. All right, what do we got here? Okay. The wet bay? Yes. This is your, uh, where you're dumping your tanks. It's your city water connection, cable, low point valves. Very nice. Sewer for your sewer hose. Yes, right here. Going to be a little water action. Fuel Gas fill up, up and everything. Potable? Probably. No, potable water oh, fill. Potable. Um, here's your power, and then there's your generator. All right, Matt, and you know what? While we're over here, let's walk around and get the cargo carrying capacity. All right, Miss Andrea, we're following your directions. I can't believe I missed that on the door. Oh, snap. Um, cargo carrying 2,378 oh, pounds. Pretty good. And check this out as we come inside. We got Asdell. Rolfstream has Asdell. And for those of you who don't know, Asdell is a green based material that will never delaminate on you. Andrea, short and sweet. This might be one of the shortest reviews we've ever done, but it's a very short motorhome. And we really appreciate everybody at Golfstream. Now, before we leave, Andre, before the video is done, it's time we give you three things we love about this motorhome, three things we just don't like about it. Andrea, what do we do first? Matt, this is tough. Let's just get it over with and do three things we dislike about it. I will go first. Okay. First thing that I don't dislike, I mean, f first thing... <laughs> that you dislike. That I dislike is the fact that there's no permanent bed fixture in here. It is what it is with this motorhome. I call this the mobile office, but if you like this floor plan and you're not using it for an office and you're using it for an RV, you're sleeping on the dinette every time or the sofa. That is just dislike number one. Andrea, dislike number two. Oh, guys, I'm going to say... I, I really don't like the fact that there's no designated pantry space. Talk to me. Uh, I feel like uh, in this, if it was a motor, mobile motor home or a mobile uh, office, you would definitely want a place for your snacks and stuff. Yeah. And if you're staying in it a lot. Yep. So, and I would want to hang my clothes in there too. Something. So yes. just a little place for like a pullout pantry yes. would be amazing. I, I concur. Andrea, that's number two. And then do you have a number three? Um, hmm. My number three is, okay. I probably would say the sofa. Talk to me. <laughs> um, just. I, I, I know what to say to it. It's just it's, like. It's supposed to, it's a jackknife sofa, so right. it's supposed to be comfortable while you're laying down. Right. But you're definitely sacrificing a, a more comfortable sofa yeah. while it's in a yeah, sofa mode. it's true. And I feel like it could be like more comfortable, you know, right. especially because you would be sleeping here. So I feel like it needs to be like a little bit better. Right. Yeah. And you know what? Uh, that might even be a weak dislike, but overall, this is very well designed. And I got a fourth dislike. What's that? The balances, Sue! You. Uh, you see the balances? I, I no. wasn't going there. <laughs> no. I wasn't going I'm there, just Matt. I'm just kidding. 
poor Sue. Sue was super nice. She was a sweetie. Warm and welcoming, and we appreciate it. Andrea, that's three things we don't like about this. Now it's time for three things we love about it. I'm going to go first. Sure. I love this floor plan style. I love, like, even like this. It's a mobile office, but personally, I like the double sofa. I think that's absolutely fantastic, having that option. That's number one. Andrea, like number two for me is going... Why are you going there? Oh, I thought you were going to the cabinet. I was just resting my arm. Oh, okay. Like number two is the Asdell sidewalls. I abs you guys know I absolutely love Asdell. I think it's the best of the best. And to get this, if the... And I'm going to combo that with the frameless windows. But if there was ever water, you're not going to have that delamination, which that's something that I love. Andrea, that's number two. And then number three. Number three. I love that this has no slides. Talk to me. The fact that this has no slides, there's no surprises, no bells, no whistles. It is, is what, it, what is. it is. It is what it you is know? and it is what and it it's, does. It's a good design. It is. Well, Andrea, that's it. Not only that, I mean, it's a phenomenal price. I mean, look, and it's solid surface countertop too. Yes. Just a fun, phenomenal unit at a phenomenal price. Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are interested in this BT Cruiser, all you guys got to do is go to mattsrvreviews.com, fill out the contact tab. We're here to make sure you guys get a great price, great service, and the best RV buying experience in the industry. Andrea, anything you want to say? Yes. Hey, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things that you dislike. We know Golfstream, they do read the comments and yes. they do watch the videos. Yes. So please leave your feedback. Other than that, I hope you guys are safe and well. Thanks for watching. Thank you absolutely everybody so much for watching. And Andrea, we'll, we'll see, see you next time. time.